RR Lira stars. RR Lira is a class of stars. The first one was discovered in the constellation of Lyra, and the star had the exciting name of RR, and so that's where the name comes from. This is another uh, type of variable star that can be used to get distance. In the case of RR Lyra stars, what makes these so useful is that they all have essentially the same absolute magnitude. And recall, absolute magnitude is always the tricky one when it comes to measuring distances to stars. So these are very handy since as long as you know it's an RR Lyra, you are golden as far as figuring out the distance. Because if you know it's an RR Lyra, then you know it's absolute magnitude. And it turns out that the absolute magnitude of all RR Lyra stars is approximately 0.75 magnitude. So how do you know it's an RR Lyra? You get that from the spectrum. That's how you identify that you have an RR Lyra star. And then once you know that for sure, then okay, bam, you've got the absolute magnitude. And of course the final step is always compare that with the apparent magnitude. So apparent magnitude, that's what we get by looking in the sky. It's, you know, how bright does it appear to be? If it's an RR Lyra, that automatically gives you the absolute. And then we're back to comparing apparent and absolute magnitudes to get the distance. So apparent brighter than absolute, then it's closer than 10 parsecs. If apparent and absolute are equal, it's at 10 parsecs. And if the apparent is fainter than absolute, then it is farther than 10 parsecs. So, uh, our, our Lyra stars makes things very, very easy for measuring distances to stars.